It's a big weekend for St. Patrick's Day celebrations in Chicago and happening today. Thousands of people will pour into the streets to watch the parade and, of course, the dying of the Chicago River. CBS 2's Asal Rizai live now near the State Street Bridge with more of what's ahead. Yeah, Suzanne, so in just a few hours, it's going to be hard to just walk up and get this view we have right now. Thousands of people are going to take over the bridges and, of course, the riverfront here to get a look at that green dye that's going to take over the Chicago River, such a big part of our city. Now, you're going to want to be anywhere pretty much on Upper Wacker uh, when that river dying starts at 10 o'clock this morning or any of the overhead bridges to get this view. We do have a few important reminders from the city, though, regarding some closures of what routes will be open. LaSalle, Columbus and Orleans bridges will remain open this morning, but that's only for pedestrian and vehicular traffic. You will not be able to stand and watch anything from those points. Keep in mind the Riverwalk closed down at 11 o'clock last night and will stay closed until 6 o'clock tomorrow. Obviously, this is just a precaution. It's going to be a busy, busy downtown today and tomorrow. St. Patty's Day's parade also kicking off early this afternoon. That begins uh, at Balbo and Columbus. They'll begin heading north through the loop. And if you can't make it downtown, there's also uh, some other parades going on. There's one on 53rd Street and South Oak Park. That starts at 1230. Now, Suzanne, all the tips we're getting from police is really just stay alert. Be nice to people out here. There's a lot of bar crawls that are going to be starting very early here this morning as well. Those stretch from River North all the way to the West Loop and to the north side and other parts of the city. So just be cautious as lots of celebrations will be going on this morning into the night. They will start dyeing the river green at 10 o'clock sharp this morning, and that parade will kick off at 1230. I'm live wrong, live in front. As I'll resize, CBS 2 News. Suzanne, back to you. Thanks so much, Asal. And don't forget, you can watch the dying of the Chicago River live this morning. Chopper 2 will be overhead, bringing us a wonderful view of this Chicago tradition. It all starts at 10 this morning on our digital streaming service, CBS News Chicago. Also find it online at cbschicago.com.